Khartoum is a very kind of distinct and particular voice within the contemporary art world. This exhibition brings together 35 years of her work. She first made her reputation as um, a performance artist in the 1980s and then towards the end of that decade her practice shifted to making sculpture and installations. The work very much deals with the fragility and resilience of the human body. I also think that there's a kind of sense of her dealing with the uncanny and this kind of scaling up of domestic objects. So you're taking something like a cheese grater, which is a sort of familiar every day, and turning it into something else that's kind of strange and surreal. I think Robe Works is a really significant piece. Um, it was a work a performance that she made as part of an exhibition which was at the Brixton Artists Collective in 1985 and it followed very shortly after the race riots in Brixton. It's an important piece because I think it very eloquently deals with her interest in kind of surveillance and sort of sense of kind of oppression. And obviously there are kind of very direct references to, to skinheads or to the police and this sense of kind of surveillance and social control, which I think um, was very kind of, you know, very prevalent at that time within the UK. I think what's extraordinary about her is about the way that she can take something that's kind of local and specific and translate it into something that I think really resonates on a number of different levels to many, to many people. For example, something like Hotspot, which is this kind of this buzzing neon globe, I think really sort of exemplifies the idea that what we're looking at today is a world in conflict and a world you know, with unrest. Um, and I think that's what makes her kind of so, so special.